Here's a bit more on the steganography. I thought it would be interesting to see how many bits for each pixel we can use before we can actually see the secret message. Um, so I have some code here, which I probably won't go through on this video. Uh, maybe later I'll go into it a little bit more. But I want you to see the little web app here. And I have this message. This is the secret message that actually is in here now, but you just can't see it. Um, and I'm doing this in 4, 4K. Hopefully um, you'll be able to see what I see. Um, as I move the mouse pointer around in this space, you can see that there are um, some non-zero values for the red part of the color, but it never gets bigger than one. So you're just seeing zeros and ones in here. That's this message broken up into characters, each character broken up into eight bits, and then the eight bits spread around the low order bits of the red parts of the colors. So. Uh, now, let's see what it looks like if we're using two bits. Now we should have zeros, ones, twos, and threes in here. Zero, one, two, and three, because that's what you can get with two bits. All right, let's see three bits. Can we see anything in here yet? No, there's no trace of it um, that I can tell anyway. Um, so now let's go to four. And now we're getting numbers. So keep in mind, these red values go from 0 to 255, or 0 to 2 to the 8th minus 1. And for you to really get a good red, you want to have a number that's up close to 255. These, are, By the way, this is the binary number, and this is the decimal number. So when I say 255, I mean all 1s, or 255 here. Uh, so we don't even get close. And that's why it's just so dark that you can't see it. Let's try 5 bits. Anything yet? Don't see anything. Six bits? Nothing. Now we're getting red values as high as 50, and it seems like we should be able to see them, but not quite. Okay, six bits. That's six out of the eight bits uh, for the red component of each pixel we're using for the secret message, and we can't even see it. Now with seven bits, I think you're going to see it. Hopefully you can see this. And so we're using 7 out of the 8 bits for the message. Um, and now let's go to 8 bits. And there it is. It's uh, a little bit brighter. And let's see what kind of numbers we get here. What's the biggest one we can get? There's 111 out of 255. Um, if we got something a little higher, you'd be able to see it a little bit better. Okay, do I want to tell you anything quickly about the code here? It's a P5JS sketch. So it has uh, a setup and draw function. And um, what else do I want to just mention? It's kind of like the Python program that I showed um, in the last video. Um, so I think I won't go over it in detail here. Uh, so this is just um, kind of an early look at this. See you next time.